everybody welcome back to the channel quick uh, video today for our friends uh, overseas asking about how to calibrate the FMT3 so we're gonna jump right into it stay tuned okay guys so we're back here looking at the FMT3 meter so out of the box typically this is already preset for you so there's really nothing for you guys to do when it comes to calibration whether it's DEF or diesel however if if for some reason this became out of calibration, let's go through the process and the steps that you have to do in order to get this thing back on track. So you're gonna have several buttons here. We're gonna focus right now on the mode button. So you're going to press and hold until you see the screen flashing. Stay with me. Here we go. So now this is where it's gonna take you to your units. So you can toggle between gallons, quarts, pints, uh, and liters as you can see on there so we're gonna go back to US gallons then we're gonna press mode now this is where it's gonna ask you if you're dealing you know with some sort of a water fluid obviously DEF or diesel so we're gonna leave it on diesel for this application and this exercise we're gonna hit mode you know which acts as a you know as an enter button then 1090 is what you should have on your screen if it's not you can use the yellow light bulb button to take the number down to as you can see 1082 81 79 75 or the reset button to go back up so we're going to go back to 1090 85 86 87 1090 once you're there you're going to hit mode and now you've entered the calibration factor into the meter so as you guys can see this is a, a pretty simple process of how to calibrate or check the calibration in the meter this is what we use on our def pumps uh, clearly we use them on our pro five thousand dollars for def uh, and uh, on our diesel products as well so simple as that i appreciate you guys watching and i hope the video has been uh, of value to you guys thanks